Hey there, welcome back to Let's Talk by George and in today's video we are going to review a app. I mean, it's really a fantastic application to use on your Android smartphone. So before we proceed, I just want to remind you, please make sure that you subscribe to this channel so that you won't miss any updates. Right, let's get into the video. As you all know that I'm using Xtroid uh, Calf ROM. So, um, I'm a custom ROM lover, of course. And today, we are, let me grant this super user request too. Today, we are going to explore an app called O and O A Bikeup X. Okay, O and Bikeup X. The application is called uh, like that. I mean, you might be confused. Why are you? Why am I doing a video on such um, such application? Well, this application can be used to create a Bikeup for your favorite applications say for example you are a custom rom lover and um, you hop in from one rom to another rom and this is something we always do i mean yeah honestly speaking with the, even with the poco m3 i have almost uh, tried uh, many roms including um, miui if not yet tried any ports but this is a great application to work with I'll tell you two reasons why. One, the application is open source. And second, the application is really good to use. I mean, I've used it on MIUI. I've used it on several custom ROMs and it didn't give me any troubles. So you can consider using this application instead of using Migrate or, um, Migrate or Titanium Bikeup. Of course, Migrate works in a different way. And uh, I have not tested the application to um, a lot extent i had been using this application for past one week and i found no issues with my backups and all so that's the reason why i'm doing the review so let's continue so let's uh, i have uh, just installed the application onto my poco m3 citrus and uh, this device is having dynamic partition too so let me click on let's go and it will ask me a couple of permissions now storage access let's grant storage access and bike folder yeah this is the thing where you need to be careful about i mean not careful about it it will allow you to save your backups onto custom destination say for example you're having a memory card and you want to um, save the files to memory card definitely you can do that um, in titanium backup such an option was not existing or i think it's a premium uh, feature so by only paying some money you will be able to uh, get that option so in here as you can see i'm having a sandisk sd card and i've already created a backup folder you can create any folder under any name and you can direct the application to use the particular um, particular folder so as you can see i have a backup for whatsapp and neko messenger use this folder allow okay when you are doing a first installation of course you can uh, create a new folder that's the way i have done it and direct the application to use that particular folder and once you have installed your new rom you when it asks you for storage permission or storage location permission you can automatically direct to the same folder which you have created then grant usage access let's do that okay there is nothing wrong with or uh, no issues with uh, giving permission battery optimization yeah let's do it let's click on allow this is the way that you um, configure the the application like i've told you there are many options that are available with the application and i have not yet used a lot of options or i have not i mean i didn't use the uh, use all options in the application so let us see one by one so how to create backups using o and backup x okay first go to the application right so basically i have enabled uh, the uh, fingerprint thing so give the fingerprint and uh, it's good to go okay fine so as an example in i want to create a bike for my banking application so this is the banking application which i want to create bike up and uh, click on the application right then select bike up you can select what all data you need to bike up normally i just need this much amount of data so click on bike up and yeah it's biking up so basically the bike up is created onto the folder which i have already created 
this is how you create backups with this is the main page and this is how it looks like i mean sim same like uh, um, titanium backup and second thing is you can uh, you have a drive i mean you can select uh, uh, which all application you need to backup and stuff like that so this is what the second tab is doing and the third one is restore so it will i am um, it will show you what all applications you have um, backed up and um, which you can even restore and schedule you can custom schedule to back up the application so basically you cl click on uh, create new schedule and uh, go to new schedule you can um, uh, um, you can you can create a custom backup for or biking up uh, or schedule backups and the final thing is settings as you can see in settings page you are given uh, first the user preferences so let's see what all languages it has it has almost every language uh, available language backup available even my mother tongue is here malayalam is here so let's try that okay let's see if uh, language options are really uh, working yeah as you can see over here bike up it's uh, written in my uh, mother tongue so that's really funny i mean yeah you get a lot of uh, lot of languages and which is really easy uh, which is really easy to use so if you are a multilingual person don't worry you have many uh, languages available with the application so you can select a custom theme custom colors if you want fine purple if you want to change the user interface color definitely you can see as you can see there is no problem with that and even you can um, navigate the backup folder from here device lock if you want to lock the application certainly you can do that um, if you have biometrics i mean fingerprint lock definitely you can enable this option also so once you reboot to the application let me show it to you again how it's been done so let me get the application up and running okay so yeah here we are it's asking for the biometric lock so uh, this is a useful option so people won't mess up with your favorite data okay right so that's about it and the second thing is service preferences encryption i've not used any of these options to be honest and i don't want to use it because i believe uh, if i i don't want to mess up a lot of things so this is something that you i mean i'm just showing you the options if you prefer to use it you can really use it and advanced preferences yep as i've told you i have not yet used it so this these all are the options that are available with the application normally i create um, backup for my um, whatsapp necrogram and sometimes even creating uh, i have i have even tried to create a backup for my banking application which worked very well with the application so it's great um well to be honest with you what are my views about the application it's a good application i'll post the download link in the description below and you can certainly download it and use it it's great to try uh, different applications and it's also very nice to support the developer of the application in a way that you can and this is an open source application so nothing to worry about and it is of free price so you get a lot of features for free that's great isn't it i really love the application so if you want to use it you can definitely use it as your regular bike biking up or bike up or and restore up once again i would like to thank you for watching the video and i hope you have enjoyed the video please do not forget to subscribe to my channel and um, see you thank you